Yeah. Hey. Um, hey. So we're just gonna switch off. I'm now playing, and I'm not. And Trey is not. <laughs> That's how that works. If one person's playing and one person game, then the other person is subsequently not playing. What if we split the controller in half and I did the buttons and you did the directions? Or what if you give me a controller and make me think I'm playing? <laughs> is that like the, the, the dad does with the kid? With the little brother thing. <laughs> yeah. I did that with my brother so much. When oh, yeah. little. <laughs> He's gonna watch this later and be like, man, <laughs> what a your <laughs> What a your All those times I thought we were bonding, Trey. <laughs> uh, no, you cannot play Grand Theft I haven't seen your brother either. forever, dude. He, uh, he's actually coming over tomorrow. Oh, yeah? What up, Hayson? Shout out. What's hey. up? So you Little me? Beast, 912, look it up. <laughs> Do you remember me from back in the day? Like the, the Hunt Club fun. and all that stuff? Um, Hayson, in the comments, if you remember Austin. <laughs> he, he, knows, he knows my granddad for sure. Uh, he might. I don't, I don't know if he remembers stuff. Good the lord, this is a fat controller. It is. It's a big fatty. So, oh my god, the camera's... Oh, we're in digging Hey, we're gonna Diggity. save the game. Save the game. Uh, the okay, I was like, I hope I got my memory card in there. Yeah, we already saved before. Yeah, that's right. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. I remember how, like, I used to be a huge Harry Potter, I guess I would say fanatic when I was younger. Yeah. But as I got older, I stopped reading books. Holy dang shit. It. I stopped reading books, and I started playing games, and I kind of just, like, got away from it and yeah. all. I remember, um... I first found out about Harry Potter when I was in the fourth grade. My teacher, Miss Powers, rest in peace, she was one of the best teachers I ever had. I was a very creative ADHD kid, or at least ADD, probably not ADHD. I was very ADD as a kid, and I needed, like, special... I needed, I needed like, creative teachers who could deal with me and not make me learn the way that everyone else learned, if that makes sense. I'm sure there are many people out there who are like that, but, like... I was a handful to deal with as a kid, and Miss Powers knew exactly how to deal with me, and I loved her for it. She passed away about four or five years ago. I found like I found out, I found out like a couple years after she died that she had passed away, and it was really sad. But anyway, it was funny because uh, she introduced us to Harry Potter. We used to do this thing called Book Week, if you remember. I don't know if your elementary school did it. Book but, Week. But we did like a Book Week, and. All the classes would dress up as characters from a certain book. No, that sounds freaking awesome. It was. I wish awesome. we did. Um, so at first she introduced us to Harry Potter, and we were gonna do the first Harry Potter. But because it is a like witchcraft wizardry type game, are uh, uh, all and we live in the South, and people were less enlightened at that time than they are now. Um, parents lost their freaking minds over it, and she had to change it. And so what we did was the uh, the Narnia books, and instead I think we. Specifically, did the Lion Witch in the Wardrobe because I was Aslan. I felt very honored. <laughs> Actually, it was kind of terrible. I don't know what I did for a mane. I don't remember how that worked out, but I remember my costume was uh, I was wearing yellow, uh, yellow sweatshirt and yellow sweatpants, and then I had a tail. And I remember some friends of mine making fun of me. I think I looked ridiculous, but Ooh. I was. Anybody got a picture of Austin wearing his? Oh his my god! Outfit? If anybody had, I don't give a crap, dude. If anybody out there has a picture of me, freaking. As Aslan, which shouldn't exist, but <laughs> if if we do, if it does, I would be honored to. Uh, forgot to do the thing. I would be honored to, to see that again, and I would even put it in one of our videos. So as a thumbnail, as a thumbnail, <laughs> the whole time in the in the corner of the thumbnail. Exactly the whole the whole freaking. What am I doing? Oh, okay. Um, why did you put the? Okay, I didn't do anything. Um, okay, you moved Flipendo from X to B. I guess it makes more sense there, though, so... I'm okay with it. Alright, so let's, uh... Oh. Lumos. It's a dollar that will stop. Okay. And, uh... So I think there is a... Yeah, here we go, watch this. Wish Look, is there any, uh... Treasure sh oh my god, that is eerie. I don't think there was anything to, uh... Plunder through. <gasps> I'm not gonna lie, this actually looks really good on our, my TV right now. Yeah, um, it's not, not bad for a GameCube game. But I remember, because I had I had really bad ADD and ADHD growing up. Mm -hmm. It was horrible. I had to take uh, Adderall and all that stuff, which screwed me up growing mm. up. I hated it. But uh, I had a teacher. Um, I think she kind of knew that. I, 
how to deal with it, kind of like how your teacher did. Yeah. But uh, I remember I was obsessed with Harry Potter, and she would always talk to me about it. And it kind of, I could relate to a teacher, which I never could have before. Yeah. You might know her, her name was uh, Miss Hillman. And then, did you go to Ebenezer Elementary? No, I went to Springfield. Okay, well, I run into her all the time at Walmart, but I never say hey to her. Yeah. Um. No, oh, I didn't actually finish what I was saying. So, we got introduced to Harry Potter. Um, our parents flipped out. And uh, later on, our parents kind of cooled down. About, and I got about Harry Potter? Yeah, about Harry Potter. Um, and so that year, at that point in time, um, I guess that was 2000, 2001. Um, at that point in time, only the first four books was out. And I read all four books that year. Man. Um, and then uh, I... Uh, I read all four books that year, and then as the fifth, sixth, and seventh books came out, I bought them. Headway! 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 <laughs> um, I bought them, and like very shortly after they came out and read them, I loved them. I've always loved Harry Potter. Um, a happy, healthy owl. I think there's a chest around here somewhere. We gotta find an owl treat. I remember. Actually, I forgot. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember very well. Um, I don't know if you remember what so I remember what I forgot. Okay. But it was now. It's funny because um like I read all I read all the books as they came out. Oh and, yeah, now I'm trying to Um watched the movies and one of my good friends, Micah, who very well may be watching this. Holy <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> that didn't Can you hit it? Hit it with me? I don't think so. Uh, <laughs> I can't even I was gonna try to mimic jump that scare. but my voice doesn't. Warning, jump high. scare. Um, my, my friend Micah, like, used to make fun of the Harry Potter movies and stuff. Like, I remember very specifically, it was, uh, the third, the, the trailer for the third movie was out, and he does the Expecto Patronum, and, like, him and his little brothers would make fun of it, and then, like, a few months after that, he watched, you know, Micah, he watched his the... Room, his room was, like, plastered. Right? I know, that's what, what I'm posters. saying. A few months after that, he watched the first three movies and, like, became obsessed with it. He's had the, the hugest crush on Emma Watson since then, which, I mean, who can who blame hasn't? him? Right. Yeah. For it, I've but had it, was, a crush it was just on funny. Her since so. like the the first movie, I saw her. Yeah, I, I think it. we, we kind of we were about the same age, right? I think roughly, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. Oh, like the curly frizzes. Yeah, well, she was a brat in the first movie, but yeah, after she that, was. And she's then that love interest happened. Yeah, yeah. I thought it was funny the whole J.K. Rowling um, talking about she wished she had put Harry and Hermione together, but and Jenny and Ron. What? <laughs> oh God! Get some incest. That's, that's not good, Trey. I remember my parents never, they never like downed me watching or reading Harry Potter and watching it and all that stuff. They actually like, I guess, loved that I was reading because uh -huh. I remember in uh, elementary school I had the highest. Do you remember uh, Accelerated Reader? Of course, I remember. Accelerated. Okay, I had the highest in the school. Well, I'm not gonna say it was. I'm not going to say I had the highest, but I had the highest out of me and this other girl. We were the only two in the school. They had these lily pads, and we were up in, like, the 700-point range. Mm -hmm. We were we were up there. And uh, I remember I used to do this for people, but I read I would read the Harry Potter books, and you would take the AR test. Yeah. So I would go and take the test myself and tell my friend, hey, look, I made 100 on the test. Uh -huh. I'm like, and these were, like, 30, 40 questions about this certain book that you just read. I don't remember 30, 40 questions. It, I remember like was, 10 questions. It was 10. It was, depends on the, the the level. Okay, yeah, yeah, So yeah. if it was a higher level book, it had more questions. And okay, so I had right, like 25 right. to 30 questions. And I would tell my friends, look, I did good on this. I'm like, do you want me to take the test for you? And it was real easy to guess somebody's password because <laughs> if my sister's watching this right now, I think you remember. I don't <laughs> know if you do, but I just got done taking the Goblet of Fire test for myself. And I logged into your account because, you know, we're related. We got the same password pretty much. <laughs> and I took the test for her and I failed it. Whoa. And her teacher found out about it. And I think I got in trouble for it that time. Beautiful. But if you remember that, like, yeah. subscribe, comment. So I remember, um, <laughs> like, subscribe, comment. Uh, shout out, before, shout out to before I get off topic, one second. Yeah. Um, I had one family member, though, give me grief for Harry Potter. Oh, yeah. She told me it was devils. She, like, took me outside, and I was walking around the house and stuff, and she was like, 
this is the devil's work, you know, mm -hmm. this is witchcraft. And I'm like, mm -hmm. but it's, it's about friends and it's about magic. Mm -hmm. I'm like, what's so bad about that? But yeah, it, it's, it's funny. cool. I mean, what I kids do and watch and listen and stuff with nowadays is crazy. Well, yeah, it's true. I mean, our parents were concerned with Harry Potter and now you get kids listening to the radio with freaking... I won't name any specifics, but it's crap music on the radio. Just plain and simple. Um, well, my, my T. Swift, she's uh, she's an exception. No comment. <laughs> At least she makes appropriate music. I'll give her that. I love my T. Swift. I won't say anything because people won't be happy with the things I have to say. But um, I was talking about AR. So when I was in, related to my amazing fourth grade teacher that I had, when I was in the fifth grade, I had a horrible teacher and i will name drop because i know she'll never see this and a few few of my friends who went to springfield may remember miss ron she was my mom my mom hates that woman to this day like i'm not joking my mom talks about hating her as a teacher to this day let's say the what, if the, what if this video gets back to her well that was saying actually we're gonna we're, i'll pick this up my, my story next time on uh on world wars gaming we'll save it end it here and uh we'll be back thanks thank you Come you back. Guys. Like, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Do some stuff. Do with things. Your life. Do it. Stuff. Just do Just it. Go out and do it. <laughs> okay. Bye.